So in this video, I'm going to do um, I'm going to do the same ideas as in the previous video where we looked at the chords of G and E minor for uh, for older children or teenagers or adult beginners. Um, we're going to look at the chords of C and A minor. All right, so C. I've got my first finger on the first fret of the B string. My middle finger is on the second fret of the D string. And my ring finger is on the third fret of the A string. We're playing five strings, we're not strumming the top string. Again, make sure that your fingers aren't gonna mute off the strings. You need to arch your hand, get your fingers right on their tips. So that you can make these nice and sweet high notes ring out. Uh, the, the switch to A minor, your ring finger comes onto the second fret on the G string. The other, the other two fingers stay on the same fret and on the same strings. They come back a little bit to allow the ring finger to go onto the second fret. Okay, and again, it's five strings, not the top string in either B. So we're going to do the same, the same ideas with strumming. So here's the B. then um, just uh, play four beats in each bar, four strums, four down strums. One, two, three, four. Strum on the after the third beat. One, two, three, and four. Dang, 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 up, dang. One, two, three, four. Up. One, two, 